you know so how about subscribing to my channel because if you've seen the movie you'll get the reference hey everybody welcome back to about the popcorn my name is stephanie thank you all for clicking on this video today we're gonna be talking about the hunt what kind of sick people would even think of something like that white people we're the more so the hunt is rated r it's an hour and 55 minutes long uh it was released in theaters march the 13th so it had about a weekend in theaters before they officially closed down in case you didn't know universal pictures did release the three movies that they have in theaters right now which include emma uh, the invisible man and hunt so you're actually able to rent those which is through prime video which is actually how i saw the hunt and through itunes and i think some cable companies um are offering as well you would just have to check with your uh, local cable company um, they are renting it for $20 and you're able to rent it for 48 hours which I actually don't think is a bad deal so the hunt actually was set to release back in September but it did have a lot of controversy apparently behind it and the topic of hunting human beings At the time of the original release it's when uh, a lot of mass shootings were happening so they really did delay it personally I didn't see anything wrong with it. I was not offended in any kind of way, but then again, I'm not like a delicate, fragile human being that gets offended by certain things. But if that is you, this may not be the movie for you. The, the movie's a satire, you guys, so it's making fun of everybody in general. So you really have to have a sense of humor for satire. You have to be able to get it and don't take it so seriously because the movie itself is not taking itself seriously. Like, there's like, I mean, the movie makes fun of everybody us and them honestly i have forgotten about this movie i'm not even gonna lie to you i had seen the trailer i think once the most twice but that was like last year i saw it i was like oh this looks interesting it wasn't like an anticipated movie the movie never came out totally forgot about it and then it kind of came back up and then actually when it like resurfaced to come out in march is when i realized that there was like a whole controversy with the movie since i've watched it i've watched it twice and again like i said i was not offended i was nothing like people you need to calm down because seriously like just take a chill pill let me go ahead and get past the political talk all right and just kind of get a little bit into the movie don't really get attached too much to a lot of the characters like the first i would say i don't even know 20 minutes if that 30 tops um a lot of people get killed off like, the kills are a little bit over dramatic a little bit cartoon um channel quentin quentin tarantino just just like a, a tad little bit because quentin would have definitely like done more guts and blood and everything like that so betty gilpin plays crystal i've never seen her in anything before that i know of i know a lot of people may know her from glow i've never seen that show uh, but i think she killed it in her performance honestly i really really like it i love that we got like a strong powerhouse female lead not fragile at all like she kicked ass towards the end of the movie there was a really nice fight scene i really really liked it i feel like it was really nicely choreographed i felt like it flowed pretty well um, i'm only gonna say one thing but like when crystal kind of like swings from like the stairs and she kind of grabs on something whatever she grabbed on basically fell down and i thought that was just funny because i feel like if it would have been like another movie that would have helped whoever was going it could have been a man and it would have held that person so they can land safely to the other side because that's just kind of how you know like action movies are you know? hillary swing also comes on this movie um she's basically like the mastermind of the whole like hunt deal her logic of why she's doing these killings of well yeah made an idea a reality and it wasn't true at the moment but because you as a society said it was true then it became true i mean it's like a whole like speech you guys and with that yeah better be careful with what y'all be tweeting and putting out there in social media world because there could really be some crazy ass people out here that are, are going to pick you out of whatever little hashtag you put on there because you offended whoever person and next thing you know you're gonna end up waking up gagged in the middle of nowhere being hunted 
You guys, that is all that I'm going to say about this movie. Um, I'm going to go ahead and give it a medium popcorn rating. I really, really liked it. I was highly entertained both times. I'm going to get some little bit of humor out of this. Um, you're not going to be like cracking up laughing. But you've seen The Hunt. What did you guys think about it? Did you like it? Did you love it? Did you hate it? Was it just not for you? Did you find it offensive? Did you find it entertaining? Let me know down below. But before you guys click on this video, don't forget to give it a like. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. Don't forget to hit the notification bell until everything clears out. I'll be seeing you guys at concession. Bye.